Uh, talk sport two. We have live and exclusive coverage of Spurs against Brighton. There's another tricky what's one. A, right? What a fantastic game that is! I mean, Brighton are flying, aren't they? I mean, they have a good result against Bournemouth. With the two games in hand now, they could really be. If they do win the two games in hand. They're point behind Manchester United and Newcastle. So what yeah. a season they're having! Fantastic. Some great games. Uh, let's I'd want look. to call that one. Spurs. Oh, yeah, Spurs would be kicking themselves. I mean, it wasn't a great oh. last 15, 20 minutes at uh, Everton where they should have really. You know, got that second goal and won it comfortably, and they put themselves well, under well, pressure. Why did they do that? Why did they have less possession? Yeah, I, 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 I don't know. Him? I don't know. I why mean, did, all you got to do is keep the ball and, and move up the pitch. And, you know, surely they get, you get a big lift as well. When is some it of lazy? Men, oh, I don't know, well. I mean, then Mora I'm, comes on, he gets sent off, and he gives Everton a lift. Well, I'm sure lots of uh, Spurs. Fans are scratching their heads saying, well, it hasn't been great football this season. They've made the big change now, the manager. Um, but there's no real, no real plan there, is there? But they're still in a good position. I mean, they're, they're only fifth place still. I mean, are they overachieving? Because you, if you look at the teams above them, Arsenal are a better side, Man City are a better side. So they're probably where they should be at the moment. Mm. Uh, down the bottom as well, Ray. Crikey, look, Leeds Palace, there's a cracker. Leicester, Bournemouth, what a game that is. Yeah. Surely Leicester have got to get three points there. Well, you, you look at the bottom and it's, it's amazing to look at. I mean, you're still looking at seven points up to Crystal Palace. So it can all change very, very quickly. And if Leeds can get a win tomorrow, um, uh, sorry, Sunday, and the two o'clock kickoff, that that is a big lift for Leeds. And I, I can see Leeds getting out of it. I, I, I didn't have Leeds to go down. I mean, I, I think I've got, I've still got Forest because Forest just can't uh, win away from home, can they? Uh, Bournemouth mm. obviously got defeat the other night. Um, Leicester now, Leicester second from bottom. It's a real worrying oh, time hey, for Leicester. Hey, what about this one? London Derby, Fulham, West Ham. Yeah, massive game for for David Moyes. No Mitrovic, Moyes. of course. Yeah, and, and I, I think I, what did I do there. I think I've done a uh, one-one draw, mm. but. You could see West Ham look disappointing in the week. Um, you're losing 5 1. Newcastle, a good side. We all know that. But that was a very disappointing night yep. at the yeah, London Stadium, especially after the the win, the 1 0 win before that. So um, they need a result, at least a draw, West Ham, to, to you know give that little bit of a gap between the bottom. Uh, so, Ray, and, the big one here for me has got to be you're there. You're at Yes, I'm, I'm looking forward to going back is to it, Liverpool. Is this, is this <clears throat> crunch time for Arsenal? Well, it's the the foot's on it. You know, it, it's one of them situations now where Man City are going to be playing first, so they're going to put the pressure back onto Arsenal. I mean, they're playing uh, tomorrow at five thirty, Southampton away at Southampton. So you would expect Man City to get all three points there, and then puts you know it suddenly puts a little bit more pressure back onto Arsenal away at Liverpool. Liverpool, you never know what Liverpool will turn up. That's mm. the big question. Being so at, inconsistent. But at, but at Anfield. They do they will lift their game because it's Anfield. They do it for the supporters because, you know, there's always been a little bit of a rivalry between both clubs, Liverpool and Arsenal over the years. You go back to Michael Thomas scoring that goal yeah. um at eighty nine. Then you, you certain games we've played in um, so that is a cracking game to, my, to be a at. big memory of the um, of Liverpool Arsenal games Ray was when you weren't in the squad and you went upstairs had a few pints of Carlsberg and then you had to come down and be oh, yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> I had to warm up, get I, I, had to warm up. I had to warm up <laughs> he's, and he's run up and down he's barely feel, swirling yeah, away he's swirling with, oh, and, and I remember a little I think Robbie Fowler was sub as well for <laughs> Liverpool when he went Ray was you out last night you stink of booze I said no I've had four pints upstairs <laughs> <laughs> but that 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 situation I always remember because we was on about £150 we, uh, draw bonus at that stage and I was thinking what a result because if I was in the bar and watched it from the director's yeah. box I wouldn't have got the 150 so yeah. I'm walking up the tunnel after the game nil-nil draw don't get on oh, I've got £150 for nothing here. Yeah. and I was on about £350 a week at the time so was, that's, a, that's a nice little bonus uh, for me yeah and did a, a little fine come in yeah two weeks that? wages in the end so I was down <laughs> I was down 550 getting on the coach. I was like, what? What am I doing? So uh, that was typical George Graham, but he, he, he was right what he did. He said, you can't go in the bar, which is fair enough. But um, well, you're, best, not, you're not to know, are you? The best no, thing you're, about you're, that was, um, I think it was Boldy. He said, well, oh, let, yeah. him finish his, let, let, let him finish his pint first. He was like, 10 for a kick off. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, Bold. I better not. I better not. I better put it down and go downstairs. But George Graham, and, and as you're walking in as well, the kit man come up, right, have a chewing gum. You stink. Really? So, yeah, I, you, know, you, could, you, could, you could smell the booze on you. And, you know, you I, must I, have I, more I, than four. No, it was about four, four and a half. I was on my fifth. I was on my fifth. 
<laughs> and it was it was half chance I'd fallen off. Uh, and what was the score? Uh, nil nil draw. Oh. So we got we got a point out. And you didn't go. And on. that's a perfect perfect result for Jordan. And you, 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 you didn't go. No. <laughs> oh, <thank laughs> no. God. Might okay. play better. Might play better. Well. Oh dear. Uh, coming up, quarter past six. Talk Sport Breakfast with Alan Brazil. Thursday and Friday morning, 6 till 10. On AM, on DAB, via the Talk Sport app, and on your smart speaker. Talk Sport.